Astrid, I'm ready for the big finale. So it's done. It is. You've killed the gourmet. Yep. And now, Titus Mead the second is as good as dead. Well, not yet, no. Oh, yes. And I've decided you will have the honor. Yeah, I won't dis oh, disappoint you. I have the utmost faith I'm in not, your I'm success, not. believe me. So Doing let's it begin. For David Prince's tool. Go now to Castle Dower in solitude. Present the gourmet's writ of passage to the officer in charge, Commander Marrow. I'm sure you remember him. You'll gain unrestricted yes. access to the kitchens, and then the Emperor. You're posing as a chef, so you'll be able to poison his meal rather easily. Here, take this. It's called Jaren Root. All it takes is one taste, and the effects are quite immediate. The Emperor will be serving Sithis before he even knows he's dead. Once wow. Mead has been killed, escape through the upper door and across the bridge. I've arranged for it to be unguarded once the alarm is sounded. Hey. Now go, my friend. Go and fulfill your destiny as listener. And how have you... Right then. ...made sure it's unguarded? Have you done a business deal? Have you, uh slept with another man just to make sure this city is crawling with imperial legion and you know what i'm still nervous you should Lazy be easy and useless a lot of they can't even hello stop right there the tower is off limits until further notice what's this go. now uh, order of his eminence possessor of these papers the gourmet by azra the gourmet i i'm sorry i didn't realize we had no idea who to expect. It's you okay. Um, you're not dressed as I would have suspected. But please, don't let me keep you. Proceed to the kitchen straight away. Gianna, the castle chef, has been eagerly awaiting your arrival. Was, was there a bonus? No. Come on, what's in here? Nothing. Oh, just do a little jump. Just nick a few gold out of these, uh, out of these cupboards. Hello. Not another delivery. I told you people our stocks are fine. Now put whatever you have over there, then get out. I'm the gourmet. The gourmet? Oh, finally. When I heard the gourmet was being brought in to cook for the emperor, I could hardly believe it. It's just... Yeah. I guess right. I always imagined the great gourmet was a wood elf. You see, really? only someone with the knowledge of woodland herbs could combine... A silence. Oh, well, uh, actually, you're not. Wearing a chef's hat, I mean. There's one right over there on the shelf. You can't very well cook without it. Why? Really? God damn it. Right. Oh, just look at you. Absolutely brilliant. Can now, you, you now stop? you're just as I imagined. Am I? Let's See you. I look, I look like a tit. Can we just get on with this? Oh, yes, but of course. <clears throat> the Emperor has requested your signature dish, the potage le magnifique. I've taken the liberty of getting it started. It probably but the like cookbook shit already, only says so much, and everyone makes the potage differently. I would be honored if we could make it the gourmet special way. The base broth is already boiled. We can get started right now. So, uh, which ingredient should I add next? Uh... Sweet roll. Ooh, how decadent. I never would have guessed it. Yeah. What next? Uh... Vampire dust. Vampire dust? Seriously? Seriously. Hmm. Yes, I guess I can see how that would add a more earthy texture and oddly enough we do have some on hand all right what next then a giant's, a toe. giant's toe you're sure about that absolutely i'm the gourmet of course i'm sorry one giant's toe there what uh, what next <laughs> 
a septum? Yeah, a gold coin. As in Come a on. gold coin? Yep. Really? Ah, I see now. That would give the Potage Le Magnifique a slightly metallic but delicious aftertaste. <laughs> Simply brilliant. You're stupid. I have to say, the stew seems done. Add anything else and we may dilute the distinct flavors. So, uh, is that it? There is one more. Oh? What is this? Some kind of herb? Are you sure? The potage tastes perfect as it is. Any other ingredient might... <laughs> I'm sorry. Of course, yeah, it's your on, most love. famous recipe after all. All right, then. Your secret ingredient's been added. And if I may say so, it has been an honor getting a chance to prepare a meal with, well, the best chef in the entire empire. I'll carry the stew pot and lead the way up to the dining room. I'm sure the Emperor and his guests are dying to meet you. I guess... I, I Yeah, I'm guessing they are as well. Let's take these gold coins. Take your giant's toe, take your garlic, your vampire dust. I'm gonna take it all, love. Come on then, let's go. Da -de -da -de -da. I might as well walk with her, seeing as... Uh, if I run off, she's just going to stop anyway. I've noticed the NPCs do walk a little faster than what your character does as well. It's not at the same speed. But aren't you even the least bit nervous after everything that's happened? You mean the wedding? My cousin's apparent murder? An unfortunate misunderstanding. No more. Can I put back on my, my hat? By chance? Cold mead, hot temperatures. These things happen. Okay. Quiet. Everything's going good Get so that far. Business with the young officer. Tomorrow was it? How dreadful! Here we are. Gods, God, I'm nervous. What we'll go in in just a moment. You should Please, be. Please, I'll serve. You just stand there and be amazing. But an isolated incident, and I have been assured that the fault was with the man's son alone. Truth is, we are. No danger whatsoever. Killing an emperor can be useful, but be friendly. The gourmet. One. This is such no, an honor. Hello. As I'm sure you'd all agree. Aha! Here we are, honored guests. Present to you, the gourmet. Ah, Hello. The potage le magnifique. So delicious. My friends, as emperor, I of course reserve. Right of first taste. Of course you do. <laughs> <laughs> Get away oh, from me. Oh, how marvelous. Sorry. Just delicious. It is everything I had hoped it would be. It... I... I think something's wrong. I... <laughs> By the gods, the gourmet and the chef have poisoned the emperor. Get them! What? what? No, no, you don't understand. That's There's loud. been some kind of mistake. I. <laughs> Can I nick anything from his body? Time to end this shit. Please, I can do this all the way. Die, damn you! Take that, thank you, Emperor's Put robes. A real fight. See ya. Run across the bridge. Oh. That man was, by far, the most insufferable decoy the Emperor has ever employed. I'm glad he's dead. What? But I'm even happier that you killed him. He's you, a decoy. assassin for the Dark Brotherhood, have just made an attempt on the Emperor's life. Would have succeeded had it been the real man. Surprised? So was I when a member of your family came to me with a plan. We worked out a deal, you see. An exchange. I get you, and the Dark Brotherhood gets to continue its existence. But you know what? I've changed my mind. How about this? I kill you, and butcher each and every one of your miserable little friends. Um, your sanctuary's being put to the sword right now. That's what I think of this deal. You're kidding. You killed my son. All of you. And now you'll pay the price. Kill him. And make sure there's nothing left to bury. 
shit. Can I get down? No. Get me the hell out of here. Those fools are actually By the order of the yard. Stop right there. Um. All right. But you just watch yourself. Huh. You have committed crimes against Skyrim and her people. What say you and your smart man? Yeah. Have one thousand five hundred gold. See, nothing's wrong. Come on, Shadow Man. We're needed. So got dragon as well. No. Bloody hold up in there. How long can it take to run through a few scraggly assassins? If they were easy to kill. Shit. Got you. Come on, where are you? That's oil. They're gonna blow blow up the sanctuary. Others so long. The sooner we get out of here, the better. What was that? What's oh, horrible in here? Ah! This ain't. G oh no. The Argonian is actually dead. I've not started to burn yet. Are we going to find the kid? Oh. Yeah, the spider's dead. If I am to die today, Oh. So is he gonna survive? Must have scared him off. No, it was me, you tit. So you are alive. Where's that? I'm starting to wonder. Vampire girl. Considering most of us are now dead, I, I assumed as much. And before you ask, no, I don't think it was you. <laughs> well, maybe I did. You saving my sorry hide just now sort of erased any doubts. <coughs> so, thanks. You're welcome. We need to get out of here. You got we that do. right. Only a matter of time before we're <coughs> roasted alive. Come on. Where's everyone else? Who's time to end this? Now you're mine. Listen, oh. I am your only salvation. Come, embrace me. I get a choice. Must have scared them off. Damn it! There's got to be <coughs> out of here. <coughs> By the way, I came in here. Oh.
don't, don't do that. I don't want to sleep. Hello? Karina is here. I'm telling you, he's in there. Oh, I'm she's going alive. as fast as I can, you stupid she devil. I don't see you helping. I'm not exactly built for manual labor. Now come on, you've almost got it. One more. Oh. Come on. I want to get away from my mother, please. Can you get it open? I think so. Just hold on a moment. You must speak with Astrid here in the Dark Brotherhood Sanctuary. Is she still alive? You've been through a lot. Maybe you should just sit down for a bit. Yeah. She's here? By Sithis, I thought we'd lost her. Let's go. Come on. Just close that. Hello. Nazir told me what happened in solitude. You poor dear. You've been through so much. Indeed. Are you coming? Come on. Wow, this is just... All the corpses turned burnt. In here. Come on. Oh, Christ. <coughs> alive. You're alive. <coughs> Thanks for this. <coughs> well, you've been burnt badly, haven't you? <coughs> Shh. <coughs> Please. <coughs> there is much I have to say. And not much time. <coughs> Are you going to admit you're a slut now? I'm sorry. <clears throat> so very sorry. The Penitus Oculatus. M Mero. He said that by giving you to them, he would leave the Dark Brotherhood alone. Forever. Oh, so you betrayed sickness. me. I was such a fool. All of this. It's all my fault. You are the best of us. And I nearly killed you. As I've killed everyone else. Yeah, you'll be judged by Sithis. No. Don't pity me. I deserve whatever fate the Dread Lord has in store. I betrayed you. And now Mero has betrayed me. Karma. <laughs> Fitting. I just wanted things to stay the way they were. Before Cicero. Before the night, mother. Before you. I thought I could save us. I was wrong. Yep. But you're alive. So there's still a chance. A, a chance to start over. Rebuild. That's why I did this. Don't you see? I prayed to the night, mother. I am the Black Sacrament. Of course, you're surrounded by... You're, sa you're surrounded by... I didn't notice. It's like a ritual. I'm saying you were right. The Night Mother was right. The old ways. They guided the Dark Brotherhood for centuries. I was a fool to oppose them. And to prove my... <gasps> Sincerity, I have prayed for a contract. You lead this family now. I give you the blade of woe so that you can see it through. You must kill me. I'm sorry, where's the bright blade of woe? What's that down at your feet? Okay, I'll, I'll kill you with the blade of woe, yeah? I apologize, love. Thank you. 
Astrid. By the sands, I still can't wrap my head around it. Yeah. If I hadn't heard it with my own ears, I wouldn't have believed it. How could Astrid have done this to us? Strangely, I feel only pity for her. She's stupid. Oh, look at this bone meal. Yes, please. is dead. Yep. It is as it should be. May she find redemption in the void. But while you live, the Dark Brotherhood lives. We must fulfill our contract. Emperor Titus Mead II must be eliminated. I want to kill the traitor well. Speak with Armand Mortier at the Bannered Mare in Whiterun. He will know the true Emperor's location. But first, inform Nasir of your plans. For you are the listener and must bind this family together. Okay, let's go find this real emperor. After I inform Azir. By Sithis, what a mess. I guess this is the end. Yeah, well, not exactly. What? Well, what did she say? Yeah. Amand Motier? But that before. would mean. You mean there's still a chance? But how? Our plan has gone to ruin. Everyone is dead. The family. All right then. Go. Go, my listener. Find out what that slimy bastard Motier has to say. Then send the Emperor to Sithis. I ah, will. But when you're done, there's no use returning here, is there? No. I was thinking. The Dawnstar Sanctuary. We could make a proper home there. That's this room? Listen, when you're finished with this Emperor business, meet Bad Bet and me there. I'll find some way to move the Night Mother. Don't worry. Now go! And come back with a barrel full of gold, huh? Bad Bet, my girl, pack your things. We're moving.